So here's the nice thing about this one is it is different, but it's also very similar to the ones we've been doing. So we have that x squared, but then there's no x's, right? So for some of you, it may be helpful to write this as x squared plus 0x minus 28. And then we'll divide that by the x minus 5. So using our synthetic division, what goes in the box here? Yeah, that'll be a positive 5 now because we're going to take the opposite of that minus 5. And then we have the coefficients 1, 0, and then the constant negative 28. And we got our line here, same idea, we'll drop the 1. 1 times 5 is 5. So 0 plus 5, that would give us 5. 5 times 5 is 25. Uh, that's positive 25. So negative 28 plus 25 is a negative 3. So we'll just tag on our x. We got plus 5 and then plus negative 3 over x minus 5. But again, it's likely on the homework that they're going to want to see this is a minus that fraction right there as the remainder. So there we go.